good morning good afternoon good evening wherever you are all over the world this is funky day funky day worldwide yes um all of us know about the um, uh, occupy lucky protest in nigeria that is even happening now um, and uh, we don't already you know talk to people talk to nigerian people if we tell you that if you want to go to the lucky protest you can go but be very very careful on how you move but today now that they tell us say they don't arrest scores men and women when go do occupy lucky protest in lagos state even before today uh, the government when they say that then they into power the police all of them including la mohammed the disinformation minister all of them don't want say anybody when go down like you will protest anything when you see you will manage them they even brag say they will kill a lot of people in the lucky protest but the news when they reach us this morning they claim say popular entertainer michael mr macaroni arrested at lucky target not be only him when they arrest ladies and gentlemen okay saturday february 13 2021 at about 11 34 a.m all right the headline says uh double Adeboye, popularly known as Mr. Macaroni, has been arrested by the police at the Lekki target. Mr. Macaroni joined the Occupy Lekki target protest on Saturday and was among the among the scores of protesters arrested at the target. The entertainer had been the entertainer had broken the news of his arrest in a live chat on Instagram. He reported said in the live chat na military regime if na military make we know say na military so make everybody the hide. The protesters had vowed to stage a protest today following the reopening of the Lekki Togate on the order of the judicial panel. Over 20 protesters have been arrested so far at the Togates. Coordinators Occupy Lekki Togate, Kailu Ajayi said many of his people have been arrested by the police and put in a black maria and are about to be taken to an unknown destination they were taken away in a black maria belonging to the lekki concession company LLOC. however there was calmness at the target as vehicles activities at the toll plaza were not being disturbed as the police continue to affect the arrest of suspected protesters at the scheduled venue of these protests as at the time of writing this report more than 20 suspected protesters have been arrested and put in a black maria and taken away afterward the police have warned previously that they would that the the police have warned previously that there would not be any protest at the target and led search to the plaza ahead of the plan 
podcast. Well, we don't have much to contribute on this issue, but the only thing that we have to contribute is that waiting on well, we not to get things to contribute based on this article. But the only question that we should be asking ourselves is that what did they make police and Nigerian government they fear any time when they say they want to protest? Is it because of the exposure of Buhari say uh, the man in Asorok say not be Buhari? What did Nigerian government did they do when they make them they panic any time when they use ear to hear protest? But before then they talk say oh because they don't destroy many things that belongs to other people like Bola Tunubu and some other people. No, but not be today Nigerian government begin fear even before that first uh, NSAS uh, protest were do when I come when lead to the uh, looting and uh, everything and destruction of properties last year. The same way when Nigerian government they take fear. I can't wonder, wouldn't they inside this thing, somebody won't come demand for, uh, ask for something and uh, government would fear. Then they say, may they not do it, may they not do protest. Wouldn't they behind that, wouldn't be the cause, when we see government, not they allow people to, uh, their view or their opinion based on the happiness in Nigeria. This is a very, very dangerous precedent. Very dangerous. So, ladies and gentlemen, now so the matter when consign Lekki be here again. They say occupy Lekki, Lagos State Police descend on protesters, many arrested, still the same. Another one say uh, police reportedly arrest and sass protesters in Lekki. All right. Uh, so, the man when they almost talk about in the whole news. One day in the news now, now this Mr. Macaroni or Macaroni. Uh -huh. The news that tells us the man, now comedian or a popular Nigerian uh, artist. Well, uh, sometimes you will begin to wonder whether some people won't make the world hear their names. You know, uh -huh. like these people, this kind of people, whether they just won't make uh, everybody they talk about them. In uh, everywhere, you know. Uh, now, the issue when concerned those people, uh, the lucky people, because for now, now only this man what they tell us see them arrest uh, with uh, twenty other people, according to the news. Okay. Another news they reach our hand about one man when be police officer. The news say from police officer to robbery suspects. Make we take a look on this guy issue and see who this man be and waiting trigger this man to join robbery. Whether they sack him before enjoying the robbery. Or instead they work as a policeman and at the same time they do robbery. Because you know as a policeman, when you see in a champion, you get you know the whole strategy when they take rob. You know the whole strategy when they take do manipulation. So he's capable of robbing and then if he catch him. Now the thing when the guy got the thing inside his mind before he joined the robbery. You know, now we be police now. Uh -huh. They know if you catch me because I know and I have the weapon, I have everything to, you know, do this game and become without being caught by any authority. Tale of a policeman arrested, dismissed, prosecuted for robbery related offenses. A member of policemen have been arrested, dismissed, and sentenced for their complicity in armed robbery related cases in the recent times, with experts 
calling for amendment to the training curriculum of cops and introduction of anti-corruption measure to rein to rein in other members of the force with questionable characters. David Friday's arrest last month came with shock and disbelief. The young officer, according to the commissioner of police in Ondo State, Bolaji Salami, was newly recruited, but his loss for money led into robbery with his accomplice, innocent Vito, a soldier attacked to the 32 Artillery Brigade of the Nigerian Army. Wana. For a fairly long time, Friday and his partner in a crime were allegedly busy robbing innocent residents in the Ondo metropolis of money and valuables, especially at Ojadele Junction in Akure, the state capital. Lucky. Lock eventually ran out of him when he allegedly stole a motorcycle used as exhibit at his duty post at Olafi police station in Adenre local government area and why he was being tried by the police authority. He again conspired with Victor to rob a man of his motorcycle using a, a using a dagger and other dangerous weapons so ladies and gentlemen all that they hear so a police may know all of them when be police not all of them ladies and gentlemen majority of the policemen in nigeria are armed robbers majority of them because the money when the government they pay them that will not be money the training when they give them are how to rob not be how to uh, save people not be how to save life and defend innocent nigerian people majority of nigerian police are armed robbers in nigeria there because you know see they want when they cash now him his own expose if they not be robbers, they know the robbers, then they sponsor them, then they give them guns, then they give them arms, then they tell them where to go. After that, we'll share the money together. Everything in Nigeria is just complicated. Everything in Nigeria is about cheating people. Everything in Nigeria is about destroying people's life. So Nigerian police, Nigeria AK, now their job it is to rob all of them. Even at night, when they finish their work, they go back to robbery. Not be today we hear the case, not be this is not the first time, this will not be the second time we hear this kind of case say Nigerian police then they rob people. If they don't rob you outside, they will rob you in their police station. You know. If they don't rob you outside, then they will rob you. When you, when you yourself, when they report, they will still rob you. The person, when they report, they will rob the person. Even the victim, I mean. You, when they report, they will rob you. The person, when they report against, that is the victim, the victim and the uh, accuser. All of them, that they rob them in their police station. Not their job that will not be today. We hear all these things about police. Even the man when they write or the man when they talk in a policeman, all of them, their hand no good. They're not be better people in Nigeria. Nigerian people, they are not the good people. Not everybody, but the majority of them. Most especially all these police and army people. Yesterday, Nahim, that clear is when they call Gumi, come and come talk see. Army, Nigeria Army. See, they don't want to make this criminal, uh, Hesmin and bandit and the Boko Haram and all of them stop. 
because then they enjoy, then they benefit, then they share the money, whether they give them, whether they allocate for them to tackle the insecurity. So we do not want all those things to stop. Now the clear is nine yana. I may not want to make them stop to kill you. The no one make has me issue stop. The no one make banditry issue stop because of the money where they benefit. Not to talk about police. When every day those people then they in the street, they march on top of people's head. CP Salami said he he on Friday was being tried for that motorcycle theft when he was caught conspiring with a soldier to rob some people with a dagger we paraded them and the victim identified them other victims also came and identified them when we were done with our investigation charged them to court some of the victims they reportedly stole included the sum of some of the items they reportedly stole, including the sum of six thousand uh, one interphone valued at eighty five thousand thirty tires of petrol, thirty thirty liters of petrol, and one round twenty-five thousand. You hear the kind of yeah money when this would take the put yourself into a problem. Thirty thousand, six thousand. So ladies and gentlemen, I say you they hear the kind of yeah money when this would be thief when you take the put yourself for prison. Although now the condition of the country, hmm? every blame goes to the Garment because they're not provide nothing, nothing like the policeman now going to receive like this same six thousand a year or a month or twenty five thousand. They will say, well, what thing will they get now? Okay, if not so, we will continue to suffer because they'll be joint police to make their life better. But when they enter police, now their life come yawa, their life come worse than before when they're not joined. Because okay, we go go begin rob. So everything have to be put in in place for nigeria for crime to be less in nigeria if we not put things in place crime will continue to climb two four seven on that country and there is nothing you can do about it if you if you catch some catch one today tomorrow 20 people will spring come up because the country hmm, not there in place one love everybody and see you people next time ladies and gentlemen i say make one of the subscribe and make one of the share my videos thank you i'll see you guys next time